everyone! In this video, I'm going to be unboxing my first Spastic Pops mystery box, and I'm really excited. I've seen a couple of YouTubers open a couple of their boxes, so I really wanted to give them a try, and it seemed like everyone was really satisfied with their boxes or whatever they got, so I decided to invest in their $99 um, add icon box. So that also included shipping. So um, it also included three pops and um, whether if it was a two pack or a three pack that would actually count as one pop. And uh, I think they had one or two um, bullseye 10 inch target um, like pops. And I'm assuming I did not get that one. I did pick the number 17. It's one of my uh, many go-to numbers that are my favorites, but mostly I got this box because they had um, Fruit Fruit, they had the OG um, uh, Frankenberry, Booberry, um, they also had Snap Crackle Pop, which I've been wanting to have as well, and they had a couple of other ad icons that I would be interested in having in my collection as well. So I've been trying to be very, very good in not seeing other people's reveals or watching their videos, but I did um, happen to accidentally see someone get, um, what's it called? Lucky the Rabbit? The, the tricks rabbit, but I actually have done that one in my collection already. So I, w I didn't feel too bad about that one, but I'm really hoping that I score really big in this box um, because the guaranteed value is at least $60. And like I said, I spent $99 on this mystery box. So here's hoping we got something good. Uh, it's always nerve wracking opening a mystery box um, from a company that you haven't bought from yet. Oh, here. <laughs> here is like a little sticker that they have for um, spastic pops. Yeah, I always feel nerve wrecked or nervous about opening my first mystery box from a company that I haven't tried out yet. But I'm hoping for the best. And I'm not too sure if um, the, t the higher girls are going to be in a pop stack or um, in a soft protector either. So I thought I was going to have three pops in here, but it feels like I have four. Okay, now I'm really confused. Okay, well, I don't know which one's to open, and three are in the sorter box, and then one is in the soft protector wrapped in bubble wrap. So obviously I'm going to leave that one for last. So here is the first one. Three, two, one. I'm trying not to look at my boyfriend's facial expression. So, oh, cool. So this is Dino. This is one of the four different colors that were exclusive to um, the Funko Shop. And there was um, 2,500 pieces released for, I believe, each of the colorways. So I want to say that he is about $20 if I remember. But let me quickly look at Pop Price Guide. And I forgot to bring up my calculator. This is wonderful. I am so ready to roll right now. Um, and my computer is broken. Awesome. And the side is being reset. Yay! Awkward! Hi! Yeah, come on, laptop, you can do it. Okay, it's being utterly slow. Okay, my boyfriend's gonna let me use his phone. So, definitely going to check Pop Price Guide right now. Um, Oh my gosh, okay, I got this. Sorry guys, uh, technical difficulties. Why does this happen to me? I'm usually good about setting up beforehand, but I've been all over the place right now. Sorry guys, almost there. Oh my gosh, the stress, the pressure. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, and I'm like sweating because it's really hot in my room and I've been doing videos back to back and I'm looking as my time is draining from my phone. Um, anyways, you know, I'm gonna have to be like real quick with unboxing the rest of this box because this is taking too much time right now. Oh my gosh, sorry guys. Now the internet is really bad. So I got the greenish one. So this one is 25 right now on Pop Price Guide. Okay, let's move on. So here is the next one. Three, two, one. Oh, okay. This one actually came out fairly recently. This is Gil. It's a limited edition from the Funko Shop as well. So this is the orange one. Like I said, that recently came out. So I know there's a green version. I don't know um, if there's any other ones. 
out there as well. I'm going to have to actually confirm with my boyfriend afterwards on which Funko Pops we're going to end up keeping, but Gil looks pretty cool. He reminds me of um, a swamp monster, I guess. So I'm not sure if he's really valued right now. So it looks like there's nothing popping up on pop price guide price wise. So I don't know what price to put for him. So here is the next one. Three, two, one. Hopefully it's something good. <gasps> Cute. So I actually already have this one. I don't know why I was really excited. Um, but this is Edna Jack Jack. And she is from the 2000 summer, 2018 summer convention. So she's probably going to go up for sale or for trade or even as a future giveaway. So I know she's decreased in price actually um, ever since she was released. So let me look her up. Edna Jack. I am definitely running out of time on my phone. So that is $10. And then the last one is this one. And it's a pop that I don't recognize. So this is from Fairy Tale. And it is metallic. I'll be right back with the price so I can have more time. So this one is actually coming in at 15 and I'm assuming Dino is at 15 so I only reached about 65 on in value for this $99 mystery box. So I want to say this is a loss for me and I know it could be better and I'm going to try their boxes more in the future. Um, so yeah. Hey everyone. So um, it kind of cut off at the end of my video because I had run out of space on my phone so I had to delete a couple of videos in order to accommodate the rest or to finish off I guess the end of the video so I last ended off on the fort pop that I pulled which was Gadgel um, Dragon Force from Fairy Tale and he is an ECC Spring Convention 2019 exclusive he looks um, kind of like metallic but he came up to be $15. So, um, yeah, I was a bit weirded out when I noticed that I got four pops instead of three. But once I looked into the box more, um, because I was actually thinking of composing an email to Curtis, who is in charge of spastic, spastic pops, um, he actually had um, put a sticker inside the box which is his logo, but also he had put um, a little note or letter to um, kind of let me know what had happened with my box. So it says, thanks so much for purchasing one of our Ad Icons extravaganza boxes. A note about your box. When I originally ran the values for the boxes that had orange gill in them, I had to use eBay pricing because PPG had not yet um, updated and also Funko app was not updated as well. Side note, um, I found out on Thursday that Orange Gill is available still on the main Funko shop. This means his value is $22 price plus shipping, not $30 current eBay average as on Monday. As a result, I have included a Fort Pop in your box. Thanks again, Curtis Spastic, Spastic Pops. So, um, yeah, so his value is $22 and that includes shipping. So, um, to me when, um, Funko, I think ships stuff, it's, it takes about five to $4 or so. So 22 minus five is, um, 17. I can math. So my box total became 67, 10 plus 10 plus 25, 35, plus 15, 50, plus um, 17, yeah, 67. So I ended up getting a value of 67. So they do guarantee $60 on these boxes. But um, after seeing a bunch of my YouTuber friends have wins in these boxes, I was, I was kind of feeling a little bit 
down in the dumps right now, but um, I always know that it's always a hit or miss for mystery boxes. And I'm really glad that um, Curtis actually put in this note because I got really concerned. So I'm really glad that I took another look into the box before I emailed him, even though he is really nice to talk to. Um, a lot of people vouch for him. And um, he also was willing to put his contact information just in case you had any questions or concerns about his boxes. So I'm really glad that he took that extra effort to put in this letter because I was very concerned until I found this letter, which um, made me feel a lot better. So I definitely want to try out his boxes again. Probably not something as steep as a $99 mystery box, maybe something pretty um, lower or um, something that is in a reasonable price range and maybe I'll have better luck in that but yeah that is officially it for this video if you like this video make sure you click the like button also make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already follow me on my different social media accounts they're going to be linked in the description below and I'll definitely put spastic pops information so you can definitely keep a watch out for their future mystery boxes as well as have information on their website too and last but not least I hope you have an awesome day bye